Welcome everybody, thank you for returning to my channel, thank you for liking, sharing and subscribing to my channel, I really appreciate all your support. For today's reading I will be using uh, the Rider's uh, Weight Tarot and the Witch's Tarot. I'm also going to do some channeling. Um, Angels, Archangels, Spirit Guides, Ancestors, what do we need to know for this reading for today? All the newcomers, please be welcome. Look if this resonates. Take what does and leave what doesn't. It is a general collective reading. But it helps when you subscribe to the channel because then you are energetically connected with my channel. Angels, Archangels, Spirit Guides, Ancestors, what do we need to know for the collective? What do we need to know for the collective? So first part is channeling. I hear, uh, listen to your gut. I think you are getting some messages, maybe through dreams or synchronicities. Maybe you see the same signs, but I think that somebody is ignoring it. I feel a very heavy energy on my stomach. Maybe somebody is afraid. Afraid to make a decision. And that's why they are ignoring the signs. Maybe somebody has to move on or open up to another person. For some is it time to move on because um, this is a dead end with a person and with others of you I, I hear that um, you have to change course. Maybe you have to be open up to this person. Uh, show your feelings so that this uh, connection can uh, come off the ground. Um, can be uh, that um, I, f I feel some uh, competition. I think that you are uh, competing each other. I think that um, you are both in your ego, you are both waiting for each other and um, it can be resolved when you are the first one to make this first step to open up. The other one is very afraid of rejection, maybe you both are, yes you both are. and. Um, I think that you're both closed off, maybe the, uh, that your person is mirroring you and vice versa, because I see the sign of Virgo and Virgo is retracting, uh, going uh, within and I think that it's time to come out of your cocoon, come out of your thoughts, not overthinking it. Uh, I think that... Um, You just have to step forward, take a leap of faith and open up to this person. And I think when you are in this open energy, you will uh, get the support of the other one as well. Okay, and if you see that the other person is not going to open up for some of you, then you have a choice you know that you have to walk away but now that you're both are stubborn and don't want to or maybe someone is stubborn and the other one is afraid to open up maybe you got hurt before can be as well uh, maybe by this person maybe by another person but um, 
we are both waiting for each other and this connection is not going forward that's what i'm getting channeled through this card wanted to show itself it's the three of wands so it's a card of waiting waiting to see a sign of the other person waiting for your ships to come in so you uh, but also your person you both are waiting if you get the green light to feel safe to go forward with this connection uh, or if you get a sign that it is not going forward and i think that um if you wait any longer this ship that is here laying here that's your person uh, it will sail away because uh, they think that um, it is not worth it or uh, you're not opening up to them and um, they will decide to go in another direction or you will what do we need to know about this situation, spirits and guides? You are both manifesting each other to open up, to be the first one. This is number one, to be the first one that is going to open up. But uh, I think that um, you have to take this first step or the other one is. closed off like i said this is the virgo card that i saw earlier but uh, i think that um, you are getting the insights of what to do i think that you know that you have to put your foot forward or the other one is uh, and then uh, there will be a transformation because this is number nine it's the hermit card and this is number one the magician so a nine and a one it makes a ten and um, a ten is transformation this is a, or it's a breakup of course for some of you but most of you you want to work on this and um, because you are both manifesting each other to come out of hermit mode, to, to, to show your feelings, to show that you are interested in this connection. It can be that you are dealing with a, uh, with a Virgo specifically. Uh, you are uh, guided by your uh, spirits, by uh, a higher force to um, move forward with this uh, connection. Uh, and something is going to change with number five or a change have to um, have to take place and i think something is changing i think you are highly guided or your person is to make a change in this connection like i already said to open up to confess to show your feelings to be vulnerable and uh, now you are both in uh, this position, the hanged man, thinking about each other, loving each other, wanting to um, be loved by each other, but both are waiting. So we have here the Virgo card, the Taurus card and the Pisces card. What else? listen to your intuition this is also the pisces cards number two to make this decision to uh, end this uh, impasse and below the deck we have the sun card so you can be happy maybe you are dealing uh, with leo specifically uh, this is also a transformation card it's number 19 a nine and a one it's um, it makes a ten so make uh, this uh, change in this connection so you can be happy you want happiness so take the steps that are necessary now you are both waiting on each other what else clarifying the magician and the hierophants you both want equal give and take you both want each other you both you both want this um, 
to go to the next level but if you don't invest in it um, and you are both in a standstill position nothing is going forward what about the Hierophant card it's a ten of wands the Hierophant is going to help you to lift up this uh, uh, this burden uh, between you guys with a tower card if you don't do it by yourself so take this leap of faith what about the hanged man the chariot card because um, the um, the divine also wants you to move forward they don't want you to stand still they see that this uh, connection has potential with this cancer card is the chariot card so um, if you don't do it uh, you will get a little push of the divine so be mindful of that what about the high priestess they want you to uh, after this false start they want you to put in the work and uh, go forward with this connection and um, work on it can be that uh, you are afraid that's per that this person is going to hurt you but uh, by doing nothing you are betraying yourself because um, you are in a standstill with this connection so take uh, this card wanted to come out as well work on it work on it or leave it you have to make a choice can be that you're dealing with a gemini or you have to make a choice between a gemini and a virgo you are the empress so uh, you know what you want so take your pick you are now waiting for the other one to come through um, speak your truth and tell what you want tell what you feel um, and then the right one comes to you so uh, it can be like i said that you are dealing with uh, a, a virgo i hear a gemini a taurus a aries a pisces a leo or uh, a libra thank you for watching i hope it resonates thank you for liking sharing and subscribing till next time namaste